So this is the TJ Maxx dupe for the Van Cleef um, necklace. That was really inexpensive. I think it was like $19.99 or maybe $24. Not quite sure. This is the gold one with the black. And I was buying it because it was uh, like popular. And I got the pink one because you guys know pink is my favorite color with the, the uh, rhinestone around it with silver and I thought this was cute too but sometimes you need to look up stuff before you purchase it and even though it's a dupe you know God deals with me I don't know about others but he deals God had dealt with me um, concerning the Van Cleef and lo and behold I looked it up found out what it meant and yeah I'm about to throw these in the trash so yeah hey y'all what is up it's brandy gish your girl is back girl so i went home and um i had filmed the Shein video after i got out of the church and my head started pounding because my husband was making some some kind of soy meat i think or maybe it's plant-based i'm not sure but girl had my head swimming so I had to drink me some water I went upstairs took me a shower and I changed clothes because I'm supposed to be going to this evening service so I want to support and I'm waiting on my co-workers to come co-workers slash church members and and yeah girl here she is I'm parked in front of her house so I'm um go get off of here I see y'all God, put your hands together all over the building. Come on, if you expect God to move in this place on tonight. Oh, come on, put your hands together. Glory to God. Oh, come on, we came for a move tonight. How many came for a move on tonight? Glory to God. Come on, people of God. Put your hands together. If you in expectation, I double dare you to open your mouth and bless them in this place and give them the glory and give them the honor. Come on, we celebrate Jesus tonight. Tonight. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. We welcome you tonight, my brothers and sisters. Pilgrim Assembly to the Hallelujah. 5th Midwest Regional gathering on tonight. Come on, can you clap your hands right there? And let's celebrate God for what he's about to do in this place on tonight. We thank God and celebrate our Archbishop, our Chief Palin. Palin, come on, clap your hands and celebrate the man of God, the Chief, the Visionary. Come on, of all of this. Hallelujah. And then we celebrate our Midwest Regional Bishop, Bishop the Priest. Machine Brandon Jacobs, come on, clap your hands, hallelujah! And we celebrate the bishop himself, our state bishop, hallelujah, Bishop Clarence Brown. Can we celebrate him on tonight? Hallelujah, our national mother pastor, the preacher, hallelujah, Andrea Hudson, and to all of the Episcopal vicars, and to the pastors and the bishops, and to the apostles, we celebrate you on tonight. We welcome you. Clap your hands and give them a praise. Hey beauties, what is up? What is up? I just got in my car. We had went to um, service on tonight, and that clip that you seen was my pastor. Uh, she had to do a little something, something to speak. What was I telling y'all? Oh, so yeah, we had went to um, after service. I was so, wait a minute. First of all, I want to say this. I was so thirsty after service and I was standing in the vestibule at the powerhouse and the lady was like, you thirsty? And I was like, yes. She's like, I'll get you something to drink. What you want? Something cold? You want a pop? You want water? And I'm like, water? And um, I said, how much I owe you? She said, girl, you don't owe me none. God paid it all. <laughs> girl, I was so thankful. I don't even like ice mountain, but baby, when you thirsty, you will drink. You will drink from that well. <laughs> Woo! Glory! When you 
thirsty, you will drink, baby. Mm. So I want to thank that lady because all, all, all uh, churches do not give you water <laughs> to drink. Girl, you will have to pay. But uh, shout out to the powerhouse for hooking your uh, little old me up with you. The water that was that was real hospitable and um that's what's up we went to the we went to harold's chicken you know we gotta get some harold's chicken and we went to the one on 87th and salmon that's like it's in the hood but it's the best it's the best harold's chicken that that you know all these other places fakes and phonies but this Harold's chicken right here on 87th the same man although they got a girl I ain't gonna lie to you be careful if you go over there I ain't I'm not suggesting you go over there but you know if you ain't scared you know take your your cutting them take your broad them you know make sure you strap it go over there. <laughs> but no we was all together and um girl they have people coming in and out and we got our Harold's and we found so it is a good Harold's chicken but I'll see you guys when I get to the house for real because y'all can't see me it's dark hey beauties what is up it's your girl Brandy Giz and I am going to the beauty supply store I just parked right here I'm at um, Star Beauty and I wanted to pick up uh, a crochet like needle and I want to do that little um method of kind of preserving your braids a little bit longer because I don't feel like taking mine out and I was going to take them out for my birthday but I might just continue wearing them for another two weeks to see if I can hold out because I have a little frizz so we'll talk about that a little bit later I'm going to go in here and get the stuff that I need and then I need to run to Ulta because I need some more lip liner I need a that spray I like that and something else I wanted to pick up. I wrote it down on my phone, on my list. But I just wanted to come with you, or I wanted to take you along with me so that uh, you can see what I'm I'm up to. I'm off today, so I'm chilling. And I also have a, op have a, um, I have a unboxing for you guys. So while you wait for me to shop, just go and check out this little unboxing. Stay tuned. Hey beauties, welcome back to my channel. It's Brandy Giz. So your girl had to interrupt this video because I have an unboxing for you guys. So my friends over at anyfashion.ru were so kind enough to reach out to me and they wanted me to share with you some goodies that they sent me. So I'm gonna start out with this box right here. This is the, um, so this is the dust cloth that it comes with. And when you open it up, here it is right here this beauty but it's not just it looks like a wallet but it's actually a like a crossbody purse and and it comes with your receipts you know how they do and this is like following the budget okay so I'm gonna place this here chain on the bag all right beauty so this is how the chain looks it's cute it's a little nice little dainty chain and you add it so let me show you the purse this is this cute little wallet like purse nice little leather and then you have the brown I like this a lot when you open it up you have a mirror it has the plastic on I'm not gonna take the plastic off right now I just want to show you how the bag is made you have these two little uh, little holes that you just place your chain on. but before I place the chain I want to show you how let me put this chain down really quick just for a second um, this is how it's made it's like that brown like leather inside and then you get your compartments for your IDs your credit cards whatever the case may be if you want you have your um, if you have like a doctor's card like your medical card, whatever the case is. So you can place your ID, your credit cards, if you got like a Blue Cross Blue Shield or PPO, I don't know, you know those little cards that they give you, you can place it right there. They have a zipper compartment or like coins and 
you have a, another compartment for your cash and some more for you know credit cards so you have a lot of room here's another compartment that you can uh, utilize so I'm going to take this out but I like this a lot because you can use this on the go so what I'm going to do I'm going to put the chain on I'm going to give you a 360 of how the bag looks this is how it looks from the side this is how it looks from the back this is the bottom the side and I love this color it's really pretty I love a crossbody I like all kinds of purses but yes this is my zhuzh so let me put the chain on and I'll show you guys how it looks all right beauty so this is the bag let me close it so that you guys can see how it looks and just a FYI to let you know I do have my phone and the phone fits perfectly and even if you had a plus it'll fit so I just want to let you guys know that and I'm gonna close the bag up and I put the chain on let me show you where the chain goes it goes right in these little two slots it hooks on to those gold hoops you just close it up and this makes the cutest little crossbody right love it going out going shopping all you need is your wallet some cash maybe your lip gloss and you are good to go okay so I love this purse this bag is real cute it's like real cute and girly all right. all right so then they give you this little cute bag so if you decided you want to give somebody a gift you can have it okay so in this next box I'm actually wearing it today because I wore it to work I wanted something that will match my shoes and it is it was in this box but I'm going to show you what it came in real quick okay open the box so I liked how they had like a ribbon that you can tie up tie it up as a gift and it comes with all the you know receipt and everything but it came in this here little cloth and it was a belt you guys and it fit it fit in here real nice they presented everything really nice but this is the belt that I have on today let me show y'all so this is the Gucci belt it's like a red leather belt I wanted like a statement piece which is the, the belt accessory brother not a statement piece but accessory to go with my red shoes so I thought that was cute to wear to work but I'm going to show you the belt and one thing about this belt is I have on some pants I think I got them from Zara and they have like really small hoops so I can't wear like a thick belt like the one I, I have right here I want to show you guys like this belt right here is pretty thick and that is the Gucci but they have the smaller ones I'm going to take it out the hoop I love this belt this is so pretty but this is the smaller one with the GG's on there. And, and this is how I like the thicker belt. So I'm gonna put it side by side so you can see the width, how thick it is. I love this little belt. So it works because it fits the little small little hoops that I have on my pants. This wasn't gonna work this morning so I broke it out and I wore this and it was it's really cute I love it um, you can purchase it for a reasonable price you don't have to break the bank looking nice and trendy you know you could save your money even if you don't want to splurge you can go on the website check it out you won't be disappointed but yeah that's what I have wore let me put my belt back on I wore this and I liked it it's just, it was really cute so I want to again thank any fashion that are you for reaching out to me and sending your girl out some more items to share with you all I hope that you guys found something that you were interested in if you don't even like what I have you can go on the website I'm sure they'll have something that floats your boat so with that being said I'm gonna put my belt back on and I hope you guys enjoy the vlog don't forget to um look down in the comment section I'll pin everything like coupon code 
the links, you know, items for you guys so that you guys can look at it. Let me know what you think. Leave the comment. Hit the thumbs up. Don't forget to thumbs up that video. All right, I'll see y'all. Okay, I did good. I only got what I came here for. It's these two items. And now I'm on to my next destination. I hope you guys enjoyed that video. I hope you guys enjoyed that video, that unboxing. I know I did not like the items that they sent me. So shout out to that company. But uh, from the beauty supply store, I just picked up some Shine Jam. That's what my braider used. Not the one that did these braids, but my original braider. She used this. I just got a small one because I don't need a big one. And that was, let's see. That one was $5.49. Prices went up because the bigger one used to be like five bucks. Then I just got this little crochet needle. Um, yeah, it was $1.49. So, yeah. On to my next destination. See you in a minute. All right, beauty. So I had to go to this um, dealership real quick because they didn't do something. So I'm back now. Um, let me see, where should I get out? I'll get out of here. Okay, your girl is back. Um, I wanna go to Target. That's really where I wanna go. Let me see, how do I get out of here? <clears throat> if I wanna go to Target and I need to go to Ulta because I need a lip liner and I'm kind of running out. I don't know what I did with my Mac Current lip liner and I had plum. I cannot find them for nothing. What's going on? What's going on? Oh, I'm hungry though. I want to get one of those um, DNA daily pot roast sandwiches. I heard they had macaroni. I love macaroni and I love sweet potatoes. I'm not going to come out. Come on, y'all going to give me some play. Stop acting like y'all ain't sweet and nice. Yes. I want to get on that side. Let me come. Thank you. See? Although I'm from Chicago, there's some there's still some nice people in the world. So now I gotta do a U-turn. But anyway, what was I telling y'all? Yeah, I want this. It's like a pot roast sandwich, and it's from DA Daily, and it's, it tastes so good, y'all. On um, that swirl Reuben bread. Is it Reuben bread? I think it is. That's what I want. So I might go to that restaurant and get that. I'm not going to no grocery store since I did a huge grocery haul. We had went and got groceries. I am not. I wasn't even gonna show y'all. It was just too much. Too much groceries, too many health and beauty items. So sorry. Those of you all who liked those videos, it was too much. So I didn't feel like showing everything. That takes too much time. Oh gosh. So yeah, I'm on my way to Alsa. I will meet you there. All right, so I went to Target and I just picked up some stuff for the week. Let me switch this over here. But I did see this lip bar, lip liner. I want to try this out. And this is in the color Straight Talk. And then I got a lip, let's see, a lipstick in Commando. It's like a nudie, kind of like a nudie pink. I don't know how it's going to look. One engine sound real quiet. Okay, so I'm gonna try it on. I'm gonna see how I like it. I also stopped in. So I didn't stop at Sephora. I need to place an order for right. Sephora. Use the left two lanes to turn left on the West 191st Street. Okay, so I'm gonna try it on. Let's see how it looks. Okay, I tried this lip liner, but it's like a reddish color, and it, I thought it was gonna be more like.
right, y'all. So I just got back in from the store. I don't know why I kept calling it D A Daily when it's called D A um, something. I'll tell y'all in a minute. But let me get my gel out my purse. And I do like this lipstick. I just didn't care for the lip liner that went on there. I'm gonna try this. I don't know if I'm gonna do this tonight because I'm a little tired. Okay. So I went to and put up the um, Target stuff. I done put up most of the Target stuff, but in here I just got a bra, some panties, and you know, girly stuff. But um, I put up the food. I put up the food, but I wanted to show you what I got. So they have like a really good pound cake. So I got that. To each his own. I'm just sharing with you all what I like. They give you chips. Yeah, it's called DA's Corned Beef Stand. I didn't get corned beef. I got the um, pot roll sandwich. And it's really tender. I'll show y'all. I gotta eat because I'm hungry. The camera had cut off, but this is the sandwich. And it has, I put mustard and mayo on my pot roast. Since I gotta eat it like a sandwich. But... I learned this through, they had came to my job, and yeah, so I'm gonna try this mac and cheese out. So we're gonna bless the food that we're about to receive in Jesus' name. I pray, take any of the that don't belong, let it be fit for this temple in which you reside, and all these things are for you. So in Jesus Christ's name, amen. Okay, so that is the mac and cheese. Let's see if it's good. It's decent for store mac and cheese. Sweet potatoes. I'm trying to show y'all without wasting it, but that's the sweet potatoes. Not bad, not bad. Would I go back? Definitely. And then I wanted to try their cabbage. It's good too. Mm, it's hot. Let me go wash my hands again. Go sit down and eat. And I'll show you guys what I picked up when I went to Alta. Just a little bit. I didn't get to go to Sephora because I needed some mascara and that spray. But I bought something else in place of the spray. So I'll show y'all a little bit later. I'll be right back. Ooh, that, that's good, young. They made an idol out of it. Before? And to the point I hear it in marriage counseling. They say, see, I'm trying to fight for my marriage. I'm trying to fight. Well, you doing more trying to fight for your marriage or the idea of your marriage than the I'm watching a podcast, that you're yeah, yeah, married yeah, to. Yeah. Yeah. And so, no, I'm, I'm embracing, I'm living a full Okay, yeah. Because Look we're at talking this. about I something don't know what that the is heck I'm essential <laughs> as preachers. Um, Girl. Okay, so I did this now. part. Really just this row right here. And it's uh, for mature it's pretty. It's in low. It's going to go some places. Because we have As opposed to, have, to this one, that's a little frizzy on this side. Can you see the, the difference? You probably can't. I don't know. The name of the but I'm not going to do the whole head. head. That's too much. We have to have the PK conversation. Here we go. Yeah. We have to have. Okay, I'm watching a podcast. I am watching. About growing up as a preacher's kid i'll uh, link it down in the description if y'all interested it's church stuff but a little bit of humor uh, that's all right let me finish doing, doing this mm -hmm. if you look at what's up beauties i am on my way to work let me get in this lane i am on my way to work but i want i forgot to come to y'all last night i did the top of my hair as you can see i did the top and it came out decent it came out decent i didn't do all my hair because i'm de definitely probably going to take it down eventually so i just wanted to um, come to you 
and share this with you. See, this is how it looks. I just tightened up the, the top. All right, so I'll see you guys when I get off of work and fix my clothes. I'll see y'all later. Hey guys, what is up? It's all right, y'all. So your girl is back, and I wanted to just show you something really quick that I purchased when I went to Ulta to find some. I went for some mascara and lip liner. I end up not getting the. I think it's the spray, the one size spray. I kind of like that. At first, I did like it, but in that heat, when I had to um, be outside and I had on makeup. Yeah, what's up? Okay, I'll cut that out. Yeah, so I went to, I was going to go to Sephora to get the one size spray, but unfortunately, your girl didn't end up at Sephora. I ended up at Ulta, so I just picked up just a few items that I really didn't need. I went in for a lip liner. I'm going to show y'all real quick. So I seen this little e.l.f. lip liner and this is in the, all right, so this is by e.l.f. It was called Plum and Get It. It was inexpensive, but I was looking for like a plum type of color or not a brown, but let me show y'all. Cause this reminded me of Current from MAC, this color right here. So that's why I ended up getting it and it was inexpensive. So that's why I got it. But I did find the, so there are two lip liners that I usually get from the Juvia's Place, which is Scorpio and Brownie, but they didn't have neither. So I went to another Ulta and they had Scorpio, but they didn't have Brownie. So I got this one and the name of it. So I picked up this one and this one is in the shade Wine. So I'm about to see how it looks because I've never had it before. The lip liners don't last too long. It's not a lot of um, product in here. So you gotta be real careful. And this is almost similar, but it has a little bit more of a matte shade to it. And this is the one from Juvia. That's the one from e.l.f. You probably can spot the difference. Some of you all probably can't, but uh, this is in the shade Wine. And it's like a, like the name. Okay. And let me show you this. This is called Scorpio. I'm gonna put that at the top. And this has like a deep, it's like a deep burgundy in my opinion. And that is Scorpio. So, yeah. So I just mix like, um, a, a, I don't like chestnut from MAC. I never like chestnut, I always use cork. So I'm gonna use chestnut and put that on it and it'll give me a, a decent lip liner look that I was looking for. So, then I was like, y'all sell one size? And she was like, no, that's at Sephora. So I ended up getting this Morphe Mini Continuous Prep and Set Mist. You guys, tell me how this work for you all I've never had it don't know never seen anybody do a video with it but okay, it doesn't really have a smell it's not like the one size the one size has this this spray this aerosol spray like you spraying your face with some kind of a uh, hairspray I don't know but I like it at first I didn't but I started to like it once um, my makeup stayed in place one day I was out in the heat and um, yeah, and for you guys, I just got off of work, so I'm like, I'm ready to go to bed. So I wanted to get this here video for you. I know this is gonna be a really short haul or vlog because um, I haven't been turning on the camera. And then um, I went into what I, I wanted to also to smell the new Marc Jacobs perfume. It's the purple one. On first, the first initial spray, I wasn't like too like excited about it. It didn't wow me at all, so I didn't get it. But I did get this Oldie But Goodie, which is the Versace Bright Crystal. I just got the smaller one because I'm 
not buying no big bottles. So I got the smaller um, breakfast soap. It always smells good. It's a classic. Let me spray it on this hand. Yeah. It's, it's definitely a classic. It smells really, really nice, crisp, clean, and good. So usually I like to wear this like in the summertime. But I will be rocking this. And I do also like the gold one. And then I was looking at, where's that box at? I left the box. All right, and then I picked up this good girl. It's the Carolina Herrera, and it is the blush. Um, this is the perfume body mist. And I picked up a small size, which is the three point, well, it's actually not a small size, which is 3.4 fluid ounce and I liked it because it was light and this is something like you can wear to bed or something quick for a refresh but it's in this cute little kind of like can and it's pink with the gold and it comes out like did I show you out? like so it has a really nice smell to it and I like it it smells good so that's what I got. And then I found a um, pencil sharpener. It's just pink. It's from Ulta. Looks like so. And the last item that I picked up was another little travel size perfume of the Good Girl. But this one is in blush and it's the Elixir. Now, this was not uh, a purchase that I wanted to um, go out and get. One of the, it was like three ladies that was in the uh, Ulta. They worked there. They were convincing me that this was a good perfume to purchase. So I ended up getting it and it smells good. It doesn't wow me at all. So I'm kind of like on a fence, but I'm glad I got a, like a travel size and not a big size. But this is it right here. And it's the Elixir. It's supposed to be like a stronger version of the uh, blush, but I don't know, it smells like something that I'm familiar with. I just can't put my hand on it. My coworker told me that it smells like the YSL black opium. But I, if it does, it's without the, like that coffee note. But it's okay. It's not nothing that wowed me. So that was all that your girl picked up when she went to... Um, Awesome. That bag. The bag. Oh my junk. Okay. And then I just went to um Target. I showed you guys I was shopping at Target. It's most of the stuff I put away. But I will show you just a few items that um I've been using and loving. And that's this Dove exfoliator. It's an exfoliate away. And it has like these micro polish you can kind of feel it when you're washing but it's a body wash and it has four percent refining serum with a h a so it looks like that i think they have like um more to the line but this one is the one that i picked up and i like and i also love this olay this is the collagen peptide and it's the firming body lotion this is good this is really good you just got to make sure if you put it on your feet and you put on some shoes you need to make sure you use like something thicker like a thicker oil if you don't want to be uh, ashy as they say or as we say rusty yeah and the other stuff is just some girly stuff they have like cute little bras that um where is this target and panties there was one um oh i did pick up the oldie but goodie which is the antibacterial care from dove this is good too but there was one item that i didn't like from target and it's the method this one is called let me see gratitude goodness limited edition body wash it has mandarin orange and lemon i didn't really like this but i'm going to use it up and what I did like from the beauty supply store is I should do a favorites video. That would probably be my next video for you guys. Favorites. So stay tuned for that. Um, this braid 
this is the braid formula study mousse it works really good it helps keep your um, braids kind of shining and smooth and whatnot mine's a little bit frizz I did do a a few in the front tighten them up but girl I'm trying to preserve them I don't know and then I brought some jewelry cleaner just some stuff everyday stuff deodorant and some undies but girl I'm gonna get off of here just away I'm gonna get up here I just wanted to share that with you guys um, just been working but um, I thank you all for watching sorry it is a short vlog but I will be back maybe tomorrow or the next day to do my favorites for you guys all right so um, let me know if you have any questions or comments leave them down in the description section and with that being said don't forget to thumbs up my video like it and subscribe I'll see you in the next one. Until then, have a blessed one. Bye, y'all.